Hey guys, welcome back to Dusk. Um, so my microphone, I, I was using like RTX voice before, so I've now disabled that because like it just randomly d like makes my voice sound really shitty. And so it's something I've tried for like a long time, but I've actually completely turned it off now because I before it was to remove my cl clickety-clack keyboard, but I figure, you know what? Um, clickety-clack keyboard is better than a distorted voice, so, you know, go, go ham. Um, uh, Fartex, yeah, that, that's a good, that's a good way of calling it. Uh, <laughs> so we're, I think we left off at the, the facilities, so, Cerro Cer Medio was uh, still a good difficulty for this. Uh, yeah, it's not intended for a full, full, full first play through my ass. So episode two, so this is the part where, um, I actually don't have any episode two jokes. Something, something Trade Confederation Star Wars. The granary? Is that how you spell granary? That is not how you... No, that is not how you spell granary. Um, excuse me? Oh, hey, cool. You know, I, I just always figured that there's a gun somewhere over here. How was it spelled? Like, grain. I thought it was like a granary. Not a granary. To be honest, that's not the first thing that they spelled kind of weirdly in this game, so... Oh yeah, a Q is a change keys. A change weapons key. But why does this look like something in World War II? Oh. Dude, you still hit me anyways. That should do extra morale damage. Fuck you. Leather man. And just with that, this entire video got taken down from YouTube. Lift skull. Oh, you can destroy that? Oh. Alright, well, let's go. Fuck. Oh, yeah, that's right. I have a flashlight in this game. Oh, shit. You know what? Fuck these guys. And I, I just took, like, probably more health damage than I would have probably didn't taken when I sickled them. Alright, so we have one pistol. What the fuck is this shit? Dude, what the fuck? Where's my... Alright. All, all of a sudden, like, the entire military spawns, but, you know, then again... This is in America, so... Look at, look, look at all the fucking projectiles. We're getting, like, some major Doom vibes right now on, like, one of those, like, ridiculously large maps. Can I... can I... can I just do this? Okay, well, that's it for my ammo for that. Visions of Stalker Stadium? <laughs> that's a reference to something, I don't know what. I should ask Pat if he was, whenever he was in the military, did he ever, like, say in a really fucked up voice, like, intruder spotted? The answer is probably yes. Actually, no, he was in the Navy, so... He's probably just handing out blowjobs the entire time. Anyways. Alright, we have a shotgun now. Now, so I, someone from the comments said that I can I can kill people with with the spinning action, but I think they were fucking memeing, so... We're just gonna assume that ma maintenance access. Is that spelled correctly? It looks like it. You win this for- oh, fuck you. Okay, that's it. Someone's getting the sickles up their ass. Which is also something that happened in, with Pat in the Navy. <laughs> it's just... Oh, right, oh, of course, the, the US military invested in jump pads at some point. It's something that came, it was an innovation that came from the uh, Trump administration. What the fuck? Dude, how many are behind me? Like, they're just spawning from everywhere. Melee can deflect projectiles. I mean, do I want to do that? Dude, you can deflect bullets with your frickin'. I mean, I, I don't really know why I'd want to do this, because they're so inaccurate, this is such a waste of time, but it's a good tip, though. I'll take that under advisement. I'm sure I'll find a use case for that. Actually, I'm gonna go over here. Actually, did, we don't have shotgun ammo. I don't, why did I even go this way? Why, why even have this? <laughs> Actually, no, there's there's got to be something here. There's got to be like an off-color texture or something. No, there's there's really just a path that doesn't do anything here. You fucking kidding? 
<laughs> now I'm not gonna I'm not saying it's mappy crap design, but it's uh mappy crap design. Alright, I'm not even gonna bother going down there. I don't care if there was a secret. Brutus spotted. Oh my god. That one's fatter than the other ones. Oh my god, he blows up too. Well, this is not doing very well for my health, but I'm gonna save it just because. Why is this? I'm getting like some corridor shooter fucking vibes right now, honestly. Mostly because everything now has a is like military and has a gun now. Welcome to Call of Duty Five, motherfucker. And I, I, and I have just a shitty pistol, and if it, and it feels awful. So yeah, it definitely feels like Call of Duty right now. Okay, I don't know. Can I, can I lean? Is there like a lean key? No. By the way, I'm pressing R right now. Dude, I just have- okay, wait, I actually have this too, so... I get the fat guy, All right? The fat guy exploded. I, for some reason, took ex uh, damage too. The fu fucking rats, dude. That rat just moved that box. I don't think I didn't fucking see that. By the way, noise, you, you, the noise you're hearing is not me mouth breathing into the microphone for a change. It's not that good. <laughs> oh, cool. Now I oh, shit, that's a sniper. Not another shotgun. Alright, that feels a little bit better. I, I was really not liking those corridor shooter vibes. I was just getting. Oh, oh I stepped in the. Wait, what? It's like a volcano thingy. What? Let me go up here. This will go up there. Oh, well, he just explodes. Who builds a suit where you just explode when you get hit? Alright, well, let's go up here. Oh. I I don't even know where I went, but, you know. Can I go up here without... Oh, I guess I can. Oh, wait, that that's a... There's a ventilation shaft here. Sure. What is this? Oh. <laughs> Well, turn and leap. What are you talking about? We found the yellow key card, but oh, is it this thing? Dig. Hold walk to climb anything. Wait, what is that? Oh, I could. Oh, it's a power up. Hold walk. Oh, just shift. Climb anything. Turn and leap. Oh. Doesn't work. What? No, it doesn't really work. Oh. Well. Hey, what are these? It, it's like the oh, they're like climbing hooks or some shit. So where do I actually want to go with that? It's like turn and leap, but like, I like I have to I have to jump. The platformer for sure. Oh, okay, so, yeah, okay, I understand the controls now. It's a little bit strange, not gonna lie. So if I leave here... I wanted to go up there. Fuck. I wanted to go up there. Okay, press E to live again. Well, this is... Is this where I actually saved it? I think it is where I saved it. Well, now I have like 17 health, so now I'm really fucking disappointed. Honestly, I've been having a huge lack of finding health in this in this game altogether. Why are you using one shotgun like a pussy? Because, uh... I don't know. I hurt my other hand masturbating. I don't know why. Well, 
Listen, there's a lot of answers I can't give you. Like, why do we need the yellow key card? Oh good, we have these these things now. So I, I kinda want to go up actually there's another way up there, huh? Or no. Because like, I just assumed I had to climb up here when I was... Oh, wait, there's a thing up right here. Excuse me? Alright. <laughs> how do I get up there? Well, I know I can use the little claw thingies, but, you know... How do I get up there? Well, I think it's just use the claw thingies, honestly. Oh, now we have two shotguns. There you go. My hand has fixed itself. One rifle bullet. Just one. And this place is really annoying because it has a lot of little goodies all over the place. Actually, that might be something that just the enemy dropped that I killed over here, so... It's over here, besides cars. It's like someone's Prius or some shit. Alright. So... Actually, I'm kind of curious what's over there. Alright, let me just save it because I don't want to do this all over again. Oh. Well, I fucked that up. Well, I want to get on the roof there. Well, I, okay, so more of what I'm trying to do is I want to know what I need to, uh... What I need to climb when I get back here, right? Because I know already that I'm going to come back with the other thing. Okay, well, let's go back up here. For some reason, I keep thinking I'm going to take fall damage, but I never do, so... I don't know why there's a fucking yellow shit here. Alright, can I do this? Oh, dude, I could totally make that. Come on, man. Uh, well, I, I couldn't make it that time because I sucked, but... I mean, like, in general, I can make it. What the hell? I guess this is where the granary was, where I came out from. I don't remember. Oh, man. That's harder to do than I thought. What the hell is this shit? There's something up there. Dude, I want to try that again. I know you can make that. You have to do, like, some really fucking... Oh, there you go. See? Look, I did it. Okay, so I think I, I think I just sequence broke it, because I think this is where the yellow key is supposed to be. Death from above? Oh my god. <laughs> I don't think I was actually supposed to come up here like this, by the way. Oh, look! <laughs> yeah, no, I definitely wasn't. I definitely was not supposed to do that. <laughs> Alright. Good to know. I, I thought this was a secret, but it just turns out I'm the parkour king, okay? Oh, this is nothing. I want that power for him. Okay, that's the secret. I, I just like the fact that I break things. There's something written underneath the Mega Health. Oh, okay, I'll, I'll go look at it in a sec. I'm just, uh... Oh, shit. Oh, God, oh, God, oh, God, oh, God. I, I did not mean to fall down there. All right. The fuck, dude. Okay. Cool. So that's the yellow key card door that I wasn't supposed to get into. Also, my health is mostly gone. Right, I'll save it here. I feel like we should just go get the the yellow key card anyways. But yeah. Do a flip. anything else unfortunately for that.
I don't know, I feel like I should just go get the yellow key card. Well, no, fuck it, I'm not getting yellow. You already know what the yellow key card would have entailed, so you know what, no. You, you don't get that. I mean, we, don't really, we just don't really need it, to be honest. I don't think there's any secrets or anything I was missing over there. I just, I just like the fact you could just sequence break the game, like... I mean, you know, it's it's not like I wouldn't consider it like like just some like lazy design or something. It's just like yeah, you can do if you're good enough, you can do that. Oh hey, this is a place I haven't been. Kind of like that because like I'm, I'm thinking to myself like why why bother going back for that right? You know. Ow ow. I'm saying that as if it actually hurts me. All right, so we know where the red key card is. It's like this way. Oh. Oh, these are the boss guys. Oh, I just died. Um, I didn't realize that they were. <laughs> yeah, we already had the red key card, so fuck it, let's just keep going. Um, what did I do to finish killing last time? I don't remember. Yeah. I, mean, I could just do this. Literally gone full Call of Duty. Hey, cool. Uh, there's nothing really here, though. Gotta go corridor shooter sometime. Hey, can we, can we, do you think we could just leave? No. Oh sure, you put an invisible wall here, you fuckers. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not salty about that other time at all. Can I go like over here? Oh no, there's a definitely an invisible wall here. Oh shit. Yeah, I got it. Actually, no way, I'm crouching in the air. I keep forgetting that cuts all your momentum. Okay, there we go. Yeah, I kind of, I kind of like the idea of 2,300 volts. Except uh, apparently the game doesn't think that I deserve 2,300 volts. Dude, this shit here. What the fuck? There's, a, there's, there's totally some shit here. You know what I might do? I might go back and I might go get the thing where I can just climb. Actually, I just need a box. Really, quite, quite honestly, I just need a box. Let me go see if there's one over here. It's like I'm, I'm thinking this like an elaborate thing to basically go get like uh like the the, the climbing thing that not because it's now mechanic I'm thinking about things I would have missed right and it's like oh I actually don't really need that do I I know I had the red key by the way guys it's just, uh... oh okay well what's that it's a secret that's how you get your double pistols oh that wasn't even oh I thought that was a flipping uh. Uh, control panel or something. I don't think it was, uh, not that at all. I wonder, can you, like, screw yourself by, like, chucking all this thing, all these things away? Probably. Alright, let's leave. How many secrets do you get? Three out of seven. Wow, there's a lot more than just the map that I got. Unseen. Oh, is that crack in the wall? The answer is yes. Hunt f plus five hunting rifle bullets. I mean, honestly, it kind of looked like you're just writing on the, on the wall. Which is uh, what I saw with my YouTube career many years ago. Fuck, is it another one of these things? Alright, well, there's pliers. Press. Stop giving, me, stop giving me these puzzles. I fucking hate them. <laughs> well, actually, they're okay. As I said, it's a, it's a throwback to like Duke Nukem kind of deal. Have they been up there? I don't know. The fuck, guys! Something terrible happened here, and someone didn't leave the red key card for me. Artifact storage, right? 
the answer is some Indiana Jones shit. Don't go in the ruins. Well, you don't tell me what to do. <laughs> That's the ruins access. <laughs> I'm, I'm glad you wrote that right there before you turned into a necromancer. Alright, this is Jurassic Park now. The fuck? Oh, for some reason that looked like a chicken to me. Why a necromancer? It's a Doom 3 joke. <laughs> it's, um, me and Ken play Doom 3, and uh, when you overcharge the BFG, you kill yourself. Um, but it would actually, like, the, just the death animation was you turning into a skeleton. And so, uh,. The running joke was that everything's a necromancer. What the fuck is this place? Oh, I've been here already. Well, let's go down here then. Doom 3 was a good good game. Um, well, the, the way me and Ken did it, it's actually just a fucking awful game normally. And then of course there's someone out there. I've always learned that no matter how much I hate a certain game, there's always someone out there that has massive fucking nostalgia for it. And, uh, and fucking hates the fact that I fucking hate it. <laughs> so, alright, so... Don't go into ruins, go fuck yourself, I'm going into the ruins. Alright. I, 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 do, I do like the fact that there's absolutely no fucking sound right now. Okay, that's not the way I think I want to go. Okay, I think that's the only way I have to go. I mean, this is, uh, quite honestly, this is like completely different fucking vibes from like, what we have just been playing. <laughs> just, just putting that out there. Oh god, it's a fucking key card in the middle of nowhere. Okay. Don't trust your eyes. I had a feeling. Okay, well it's dead. Because I, I heard it getting closer, and I'm just like, uh, yeah. I, I, I believe you, I've never played this before, so, uh, just thought it was invisible. Okay, so there's this thing here, I want this. How did you get out? Oh, I guess that's a regular enemy now. That's just gonna be invisible. You hate invis shit like that? Yeah, we all do. Dude, how do I get that? Curious. Just looking around. Also, you know what? To be honest, the the hint of "don't trust your eyes" was pretty telling. Of like, oh, just because you can't see it doesn't mean it's not there. Dude, how, how the oh right here? Oh, that's how it came out. That's a secret. Oh, it's a mortar. You don't discriminate against colors, but invisible is not a color. Fucker. So basically, you have to just. It's an enemy that you have to shoot once to make it uh, visible, essentially. So. Which kind of sucks, but, you know. I mean, but it's pretty obvious by the audio cues, but can you imagine playing this when you're deaf? <laughs> Excuse me, it's not a very accessible game, but, you know, well, technically it's not, but. Whatever. Can I do anything here now? That's it for that clip, those guys. What the fuck is all this shit? How do you want to bet that those guys are gonna now work together with the other ones? They're all gonna be on the same team to fuck fuck me over. Just cause I'm the dusk man. I thought that guy would blow up. Apparently not. Don't trust your eyes. He did? Uh, I guess I didn't notice. Because I just saw his friend just walk over him. Why does it have to make that noise? It's like, a, it's like it's a shock every time I see it, but I know he's in the fucking corner here somewhere. 
I honestly, you know what? Um, after now seeing the enemy a couple times, it's actually a pretty cool mechanic when you think about it. Completely invisible, you gotta basically use your sense of hearing to basically see, see it. And for all I know, there could be some accessibility option where it lets you kind of know that there's one around. You know? Oh, shit. Oh, it's this guy. I kind of want to get what's in there. 48 health is not an acceptable amount of health. I, I hate to say it. Oh, these barrels don't blow up. Trust the force, Luke? I mean, that's essentially what they're going for, I believe. Oh yeah, I've already been there, actually. I forgot about that. Alrighty. Back out, here we go. Oh, there's actually a health pack right here. Let's go get that. Large ass silo. This is a meme from something. I forget what though. I think it's like Metal Gear thing. The rocket silo in Half Life 1, but it wasn't like a memorable, really annoying part. Sounds like a Kojima thing, honestly, but I haven't played Metal Gear ever, so... Even though I have, like, two of the games. I think on Steam. I kind of wish they put the entire library for Metal Gear on, on Steam, then I would actually play it. Because I, I feel like, like, why would I want to, like, play, like, a random-ass, like, one in, like, the fifth one in the series when I want to kind of start with the first one? Well, okay, maybe not the first one. That was, like, NES shit, but, you know... Okay, you know what? Oh, 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 oh. I'm gonna go to this weapon. Oh, well, I just killed all of them. Hell yeah. I don't, I don't start a series at the fucking fifth installment, I'm sorry. Yeah, well, let's stay in the level. How many secrets did I get? I wonder. Three out of four. So I missed one. Because I felt like I was kind of on top of the secret game there, but you know. Into this Thresher. I, I'm going to say the vibes got a little bit different, though. <laughs> you start with the spinoff by playing Re Revengeance? Yep, yeah, that one seems like a spinoff. I don't know. You, you know what I think it is? It's I'm so bad at stealth games, I want to play a stealth game. Like, have you fucking guys- have you fucking guys seen me play like, uh, what was it? That- that Splinter Cell game? Like, uh, I, well, being candid that one, I was fucking- That was- that was me and stealth games in a nutshell, alright? In fact, I think I tried to play Deus Ex. Playing like kind of like a more stealth specialization, I sucked ass at it. Like it was like actually just the worst thing. That was me trying, and I did a really terrible job. Oh, I can't quite go down there. I'll admit, I'm just I'm just not a stealth guy, you know. I'm just really bad at it. Maybe it's for the best that you barely play the Vampire Masquerade. I, well, I think I tried it as a part of a Halloween stream, but that one was like, uh... I, I don't know... I don't, what did I think of it? I don't remember, actually. What did I say at the end of it? Was that like it wasn't for me? I guess if I didn't play it again, I guess I didn't really like it, did I? Because I played this at the Halloween stream, and I'm like, yeah, boy! Boomer shooters, why not? 
I was totally fucking down for that. There, then there was like that 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 the new Aliens game. Um, basically, I, I I think like three Halloweens in a row, I I played it, <laughs> just but never finished it. <laughs> oh, it's some fuckers over here, fuckers. Okay, you know what? Is this the proper weapon to use for these guys? I think it's not. I think the hunting knife is what I want. Wait, you're a fucking piece of shit. Okay, I just died to like I don't know what. Because I'm bad at stealth, that's why I died. Did I already go up there? I think I did, but I'll just do it again. Okay, I guess I didn't. So if I had more time for video games, I'd probably finish uh, Pirate's Moon 2. I can't believe I didn't finish that, because I am not the only one who didn't finish a, a fucking playthrough of that. There's another guy like, Shaved something flaxy or something uh, that didn't finish it either. It's a pirate's moon that now has like I think no complete LPs for the entire website. But don't worry, I'll finish Dusk. Famous last words. Oh, that guy is probably what killed me. Actually, I, I honestly felt like like it was really random how I died. Okay, you know I don't care about that guy. It was one of those red dudes with the, the fires the homing projectiles. Oh wait, these guys are different. What the fuck dude? Oh, it's a turret! Why do they have like all the asshole enemies in this place? Oh, and I see another one of those red fuckers here too. Okay, I need the hunting rifle again. Oh my fucking god, this is fucking atrocious. Alright. This guy's an asshole. Okay, where are you? Come here. Fuck, I missed him. Was that hunting rifle ammo? I hope it was. I, okay, actually, we just got a completely new hunting rifle, so that, you know, that works pretty well. You mean this isn't the Soviet campaign of an alert? I don't know if I'm gonna finish that either, to be honest. I, I Like I said, I'm, it's one of those things that it's been so long ago that I, I did dinner alert, I'm like, fuck, man. Who the fuck dares? Guess this guy dares. Okay, well, now I just have randomly fucking 22 health. And there's still, there's this asshole that's shooting me. This guy, like the guy who was like basically a boss is now just a regular enemy. I think he was a boss actually, I don't really remember. Or no, no, it was two guys. Yeah, now, now they're just all over the fucking place. Look at these guys. Assholes. Apparently they weren't so unique after all, you know. I don't have a good track record with games, what can I tell you? That has some really floaty physics, holy shit. I I was not expecting that to go so far. Actually, there's a health pack right here. Oh goody, my shotguns run out, so that what does it switch me to? The fucking pistols. <laughs> I hate the pistols so much. Every fiber of my being. And then there's this chainsaw dude who uh did not pick a good weapon for this fight. This do door opens elsewhere. We should have a door that opens everywhere. I'm just wondering if uh these open. I guess not.
I have to say, it's a, this this game turned a little bit weird because it's like I I I felt it was different in the first act, but it's not a bad kind of different. It's still the same thing, but it's just changed. Can't handle change, guys. But like, it, it basically it set my expectations and then it changed them. So now I'm like, what? I I, I don't know how to describe it though. Uh, oh, there's a health pack right here. Oh. I mean, it's a little bit more open-ended, but then again, we had that weird level with like the. Um, we've we've had, we've had some pretty strange levels. So, oh wait, we have to go here. I was like, I was like, have I seen a yellow key card anywhere? And the answer is yes. True spied. It's mo it's honestly it's mostly the Call of Duty guys, these dudes. Actually, I probably shouldn't waste ammo for this thing. Excuse me? Oh, it's a fucking turret. Dude, like, what the fuck, dude? This is why I feel that way. I feel like I'm, I'm now corridor shootering. That's... When, when before, I would just go fucking ham on shit. Um, and now there's this thing here. That's why. The enemy types completely fucking changed. Well, what was the default enemy before? I don't even fucking remember at this point. That just look like these guys just appeared at the end of like the last campaign, and I was like, oh okay. That's and there's this invisible fucker. Oh, keep hearing the fucking breathing. The worst part is, uh, I had ammo for that that gun and which whatever gun that was. What the hell is this shit? Oh, it just wants me to go through the blue door now. I had ammo for that gun, that the crossbow weapon, and and like, dude, what the fuck? <laughs> oh yeah, it was like scarecrows and something else that we constantly saw. Then again, you know what? It did change like its its place. It was basically like saying like, "Hey, you're in the facilities now." So you know, you know, I can't really say. Oh fuck me! Sideways. Okay, well, dude, I have like no ammo for anything I like. Do you, do you hear that noise? It's being- it's jumping up somewhere. Oh wait, wait, what? Dude, I know they're there. I can see the fucking footsteps. Yeah, they're there. Pieces of shit. They put two of them in this room. And they're very confused on how to deal with life. What a bunch of assholes. <laughs> they put two of those things. The honey mode is over, like, it's like you married Mon it's like you married Tom Cruise. Yeah, I'd fucking say. What the fuck, dude? Cause like I can hear them jumping on the thing, right? So I'm just like, what the fuck is going on? Oh my god. Alright, I'm 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 liking these enemy types a little bit less than I than I used to. This door opens also, go fuck yourself. Open here. Cause I tell you to. I mean, imagine that was a real thing. All hail the great thresher. Okay. Imagine you had to go into your house and like you just your front door was like this door is a door that opens elsewhere. Okay, it's like it's like it's I know it's like a quake thing and shit. They used to do that all the time. To be honest, though, it wasn't a very good game design choice, uh, which is why they stopped doing it. Um, but you know, it is what it is. Okay, we've been here before. How do I... What kind of ammo is this? Is that assault? No, it's not assault. Oh, it's hunting rifle. Yeah, it's the one thing I haven't been using, have I? Any health packs or anything? Actually, I don't really need them, do I? 
I'm not gonna say I'm not gonna say this is a bad game. Though. It's still it's still really good. It's like a giant tank or something. No. I mean, I remember there was one game that really changed from when I started to play it until the end. And the worst part about that one was it was a um, a game the developer actually gave to me because uh, he wanted to, his exposure for his game, and I had nothing good to say about it at the, when he finished it because he changed it. And do you guys know what game I'm talking about? It's a uh, what was it? It was Rack. That was it. It started so good. It was. It was like. Well, it wasn't. I wouldn't say it was so good. It was. It was pretty good. It was like the first of like kind of like what Dusk is, like one of those throwback shooters. And then you know what he does? Like, uh, like the the entire final act is essentially like, um, uh, like a like a fucking dodge puzzle shit, uh, which ironically is what kind of this is right now. <laughs> but no, no. But it was like like mines everywhere and some other bullshit, and I was like. Like, it was really annoying. And and I didn't like it, and he knew I didn't like it, and so he stopped talking to me. Even though, like, I would have, like, honestly, if I had, like, beta tested for him, I probably would have, like, had feedback for him, but his game didn't do that well, um, unsurprisingly. I, as far as I know. As far as, it, maybe I was, maybe I'm wrong, maybe it did do okay. If you look out on Steam, it maybe did okay. Sacrifice. Uh, yeah. Dude, we're going to the Crusher, man. Getting some Half-Life 1 vibes. 3 out of 7. I is it that Cell Shade game? Yeah, that, that's it. That's the one. Did it do well? I don't remember. You put a lot of... You're, the fall broke your flashlight? Go fuck yourself. I'm going to the fucking shadow thing. The fall broke your flashlight. See what I mean? Like, it keeps changing. <laughs> it's like, it's a horror movie now. <laughs> save us, and like, dude, save me from fucking crushing it here. 9,000 and 1. I mean, to be honest, like, it, what if I was like playing like Half-Life 1 for the first time, right? I would be like, what's this Zen shit? It completely fucking changed everything. Fuck me. Fuck Half-Life 1, but it actually ends up being pretty good, right, Half-Life 7. So I can't really say anything. Alright, just as I was mocking Rack for doing this kind of thing, at least I could say whatever I want this time. It's not like the developer gave me this. I actually paid money for this, so I can, I can, I can, I can shit talk it and not feel bad. What did I get? Did I get a key card? What, was the, what the fuck was that? You don't hate Zen? You enjoyed that level when you played it? Yeah. I'll say hello. Um, dude, when, when, when is my flashlight gonna fix itself? Door opens elsewhere. Oh, fuck this guy, honestly. Oh, you found a working flashlight! That's funny. I actually, I, I actually enjoyed that. And now I just pulled some bullshit where it had a bunch of shit come behind me. Fuck off. All right. Oh god, that is, dude, it's a coronavirus man. Fuck that guy. He's in, dude. He's just in the pooper. Actually, you know what? Can't we can't call him that? Just the dude with the needle returns. <laughs> Just laughs at me. It was a really funny shitty toe, trust me. Alright, that's enough toilet humor, never again. Only only pat humor for now on. The worst kind of humor. Alright, what's down here? Oh, I feel like I shouldn't have gone down here. You missed the soap? Apparently soap was overpowered because they never we never we've never seen it again. What's the point of this thing? Oh shit. Uh go over here. Dude, really? Another crusher. Alright, well I guess we're going to the new crusher. 
See, we're, this is literally Pat's fucking level. I'm just telling you. Like, there's a crusher here, there's military dudes. Dude, it was fucking designed for him. Why does this not have co-op that I can just make fun of him all day? But instead I have to make fun of him when he's not here. Which is what I would do normally, so... So that opens elsewhere, that does nothing. Oh, wait. What the fuck is this shit? Actually, wait, it, it was killing them for me. Just to illustrate the dangers of uh, spinny blade things. Oh goody, the sickles. It's like a WWE cage, cage fight. Don't shoot the button. I'm gonna shoot the button. Joker. Fuck. Okay, dude. Oh my god, I'm so bad at video games. Alright, well I shot the button. Which is something I wasn't supposed to do, so... Just opened up this thing here. Oh, I need I need this thing again. I'm gonna guess that I really wasn't supposed to shoot the button though. Actually, I don't know if it opened the way forward. I wasn't really paying attention, honestly. I feel like I missed like a ton of stuff from the. Oh my god! It's such a psychedelic room. Holy shit, guys! Also, this is like really low res over here. I'm like, I'm like, I'm, did I miss something in this room? I don't even know. I feel like I just skipped past a bunch of stuff. All right, before we before we deal with the psychedelic room. I kind of want to look a little bit back there, because I'm actually kind of curious now. Dude, fuck the soap. Look what we have here. We have Psychedelic Room. This is just the time to fucking do mushrooms and just look at that room. Just stand right there. Oh yeah, there is something there. Look at that. So I thought. kind of want health, you know. I just figured I missed it. Something there. Oh wait, there's something over here. What the fuck is with these crushers, dude? What? Why would you plant me back here? Well, I'm just finding secret after secret, to be honest. So you know what? some reason I want to be here, I don't think there is. Uh, really not. It just, it just made me go all the way back for no reason. Well, it didn't make me, I did it myself, but you know. If I can't play games, what can I, what, what can I blame then? So we got that. There's something over here though. Why does it like go around and oh wait, it's a circle. That's the other thing I thought I was missing. Oh, there's a blue key card door. Do I have blue key? No. I got that. Because there's that psychedelic room. And that's it. Am I supposed to like... I don't, I don't, dude, what's down here? I need to know now. 
Oh. <laughs> this is such a this is such a convoluted level, I'm not gonna lie. It's so weird. Oh, it brings me back here now. Okay. So now everything's connected. Dude, let me just see down here. Cause, oh, right here. There's a hole I wasn't paying attention to. Where's my grenade launcher? Okay, well, now, now it's literally hell. Okay, well, it's a secret. Which is, I'm sure, the message you see if you actually get, get into hell somehow. Is this waste processing level of Half-Life? That's what I'm fucking saying. Alright, we're back here. This is like, this is some major, like, Padlat throwbacks, I'm telling you right now. I've, I've now unironically made that more difficult for myself to jump across it. Alright, well, let's go back upstairs. Because that, I felt like I just hadn't fully explored this place, and so now we can go see what the weird psychedelic room does. I'm just looking at this room, man, because I'm just like, dude, there are secrets everywhere. Alright, psychedelic time. Alright, guys. Smoke them if you got them. What the hell is this place? Oh. Well, we undid the fucking machine. Oh, here we go. Fuck. Well, I actually didn't lose as much health as I thought I did. You know what my favorite part was when I got into this level and goes, you fucking broke your flashlight, you fat ass. That was the best. Good times. I was looking at if there's anything to jump up to. I fucking hate these guys. These piece of shit. Okay, he's dead. All good. So we got a blue key card for our troubles. And there happens to be a blue key card door over here. Killed the machine while the machine was trying to kill me like half the fucking time. What the hell is this shit? <laughs> fucking rats. I, I honestly, I'm also getting vibes that I don't get a lot of flipping health in this. This door opens elsewhere. I figured there's one other thing missing in our arsenal when we found it, so. It is a very unique enemy though. I don't know many other enemy uh, many other games that has like an enemy like that. How does this door open elsewhere? Go fuck yourself. Where's the door opener thingy? I realized that you could crouch jump up there. Yeah, I can. I got a ship. Dude, how do we... Wait, wait, wait. Um, thought maybe this is like a false wall or something. I don't see any switches or anything. What the hell is there a thing here? This door opens elsewhere. Maybe that's the button I wasn't supposed to press, you know? Actually, wait, one second. You like how in, in, in video games it's always the fat guy that explodes? And also real life. Maybe, I don't know. Oh, there's a Blood Suka and, and Stalker, right? That is one that is invisible, sort of. Yeah, I, I, guess, that, I guess that does count. Alright. So never mind, it's not our, it's not our original idea. 
Minus, minus 3,000 points for this game. You convinced me, I'm never playing this again. Just like Mechware or not. A hatch has been opened. What the hell's that noise? Feels like someone's trying to get my attention. Super Shock is pretty good at dealing with this. Why fall when you can leave? Dude, I missed like 20 enemies there, what the fuck? Oh dude, it's the it's the S Esker Labs. Welcome guys. So, so, wait, wait this is, I'm getting, like, <laughs> we went from, like, some fucking sewer saws to, like, oh, here's the Escher Labs, guys. With, dude, this guy is so happy. Look at this. Appears to be a cult leader, so it's probably, like, the developer. Don't have time to play with yourself. MC Escher is my favorite MC? Exactly. Oh. Or dude, are they gonna have some MC? Okay, that probably shouldn't shock it, shot him so close to my face, but dude, I'm not going to the radioactive room. What the fuck, dude? I'm never allowed in the radioactive room. I'm gonna be really disappointed if they're not gonna make some really fucking janky ass fucking janky ass things here. I'll be honest, like, those guys aren't actually that hard to deal with, simply because of the fact that given, given when they activate and, and try and kill you, you kind of have an idea of where they are. So, for example, like, I went around that corner, right, and then, uh, and then I kind of heard the noise of him, right? So I kind of knew, oh, he's not going to activate unless he sees me, right? So, you know. Okay, so something else opened somewhere else. So they were like experimenting on cows. I mean, that's that's where your meat comes from. So, and they had a fucking fast fire thing in the back of the room, which I probably shouldn't have picked up. their traps now. Secret government facility under farm lines, how original. I mean, I would say it was underneath the farm lines, but maybe it was. I mean, we, we did really clearly go to this on purpose, so I kind of feel like, I'm kind of feeling mortars, honestly. Go on, take it. Taste the power. So do I like turn into a horse? Oh no, this is like a berserk pack. I see. Or like, I don't really know actually what the fuck this does. <laughs> I, it felt like I did more damage, but I'm, I'm not too sure. The other one was pretty obvious because it's like, oh, you you did other things. It said on the screen, did it? Oh, I, I completely fucking missed it. I was like, ad blind or some shit. Sorry. Do you think I pay attention? I just saw the I just saw the red bar, that's, that's, and then I saw things to shoot at. 
It, time only moves when you move. Oh! Oh, okay. I, I kind of saw things slowing down, so... I wasn't sure what that was. Dude, I actually want to try that thing again, because I totally wasn't paying attention to that. I like the guy with the assault rifle just runs point blank to me. What is Chad? Oh, yeah. A door opens. Thanks. Just a door somewhere. There, this is open now. Sonic something? Alright. Oh, there's a gas canister. So this dude. Oh, it opens up this thing now. I see. It's like it's super hot? Yeah, no, no, I, I get it now. At the time, I didn't understand what, what it was doing. I, was, I just panicked because there was too much going on. This is regular heavy breathing. Dude, why, why am I messing with these guys' lab? Like, I, I have no quarrel with these guys whatsoever. So I, I never picked up a key of any sort over here. Why was I up here? Oh, because a door opened somewhere. And the question we all ask ourselves is why? Probably somewhere around here. Something isn't right. Well, I mean, he has red eyes now, so... <laughs> Question marks. Welcome to Escher Lab. So it just completely changed the labs, or what? Oh, it's... Oh, I see. It's upside down now. Oh, yeah. It's like completely changed everything, kind of. The fuck? But, like, this secret is still open. With the things being dead. Did just remove- I, I think it changed the hallway. That's- this is weird. Dr. Freeman. Hey, do you think the green kills me? The answer is no. It's really tr oh my god, it's such a trippy level. What the fuck? This is so so fucking awesome. Holy shit. Yeah, I, I kind of expected something like this, to be honest. But it's called the Escher Labs. Jeez. Rude Mike thrashing the place. You know, I, I don't think I had anything to do with this. I think this is not my fault. is like super happy about something. Oh, well, let's go go like, what happens if I fall down there? And I'm like, well, I guess we'll find out now. Because I just fall down here. Oh, it just goes all the way back here. Oh, fuck me, right? She got stabbed. I don't want to turn into a horse. Oh, well, there's the yellow key card. Hey, we're back here, I think. 
You know, I have to say, um, one of my complaints is not the level design. Holy shit. What the fuck? Where's my, uh, where's my shooty rifle? There it is. Oh, he's dead. Dude, the maximum effort went into this. Holy shit. Stop it. Stop it. I guess some health things there. I, you know, it's it's levels like this that you kind of want to take apart in the editor and kind of like figure out what they did to make to make these tricks happen. Someone had a lot of fun with this. Uh, I don't have a red key card. Just realized. This is how Santiago died in the record backer. Uh, yeah, I. Probably. <laughs> You're not wrong. Well, I think that's a thing I can just... Oh, wait, maybe not. I was gonna say, I think I can blow him up, but you know, I'm gonna try it anyways. Okay, I guess I can. Well, huh. So I need a red key card. I have the yellow key. This is like some bullshit where, like, I don't actually need it, no? I do need it. I don't have a red key card for this, so. Door opens. I, I think I pressed that one already, to be honest. Yeah, it has to be here. This is the yellow key card. Right? Oh, wait, there's a. What? Was that there before? That wasn't there before, was it? Don't. Well, I'm gonna do it. Oh, Jesus. This guy's a fucking asshole, anyways. We're back here. Nope, it wasn't there? Alright. Maybe I did. Maybe I had to press the switch again, or I don't know. Or maybe it was like just like tricking me into coming back and backtracking and shit. I don't know. Eh, I want to see what's in here. The answer is nothing. Save yourself from what? This place is amazing. Uh. Yeah, my ping exactly. <laughs> this door opens elsewhere. I, I don't think we want to really know what's going on in there, to be honest. You guys just leave some people to your privacy, right? Uh oh, the tank opens. Oh my god! <laughs> That was <laughs> fucking not what I expected at all. Am I a mom? What's up? Usually only moan in the bedroom with dad. What the fuck is this shit? Oh god. What's over here? Oh cool, blue key card. Okay, I fucking died. Okay, here's a here. Here's what we're gonna do. I wonder, can I like, can I cheese this? Cause we know she's there, right? Okay, well, she clearly is not having any fucking part of that. I'm gonna save it here, just because I like to save things. Dude, was she just head bobbing? Alright. This has been a very interesting level so far. 
metal tits, I wouldn't notice. <laughs> Look at all these guys. Dude, every time they see me, they're so happy to see me. Like, like, why, why would I, why, why should I shoot them, dude? They're so happy. Okay, this is like, definitely like one of the most trippiest levels I've ever fucking seen, to be honest. I want that big, I want the goodie. Yeah, boy. I mean, this is a pretty fucking cool level, I won't lie. That was, that was, I think, one of the best levels in the wild that I think I played for any, anything, like, games.